Matt Backman here, Gilson Engineering, and today I've got a thermal mass flow meter from Fluid Components to here to talk about. So thermal mass meters are interesting because they essentially use wind chill factor to measure what the flow rate is. Here I have a flow element from a flow meter, and you'll see I have two RTDs coming out of the end of this element. One's heated, one's not. The one that's not is measuring the reference temperature of the gas to do temperature compensation, and the one that's heated as any kind of gas flows past it, it strips heat off of that RTD, and that's how it measures what the airflow rate is, and conversely, can calculate what the actual cubic feet per minute or cubic feet per hour are. So it's got a very large turn down ratio of about 100 to one or better, and also it measures directly mass flow rate, so there is no pressure temperature compensation. The meter does that all internally, so that it's actually outputting mass flow rate. If you have any questions or want to learn more, give us a call.